back to the channel once again. Uh, video, as I see, video. It is part of my Christian and to discuss with Sarah Logot. Aro Sarah, uh, he Kobo uh, Christianity at a Kenequa Ki Ki Mizo Kenequa Sop Kinikota Kobo. Keep watching the video. Sarah, I'm also going to go to the house. I'm 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 going to go I'm here to do uh, in Mizoram for the first time and yeah. very new to this place and I have no idea about uh, about about the Mizo people. I have little idea now. I have visited to the Chakma village. I have little idea about them, but I have no idea about the Mizo people. So I have little questions. Firstly, please introduce yourself, sir. I am Mai Juala of Chongte P. Okay. Then I am a headmaster of Government Harmon Middle School, okay. Chongpea. I work as a headmaster for 28 years now. Uh, still you are uh, uh, a headmaster or you are retired? No, I am serving till date. Okay. So I am going to retire in the year 2024. 20, 2024. 20, 20, 20, so sir, uh, my first question is like, uh, uh, in Mizo people, uh, how at at which age they used to marry uh, uh, each other? But I mean, a boy used to marry in this age, and girl. At, at what is the uh, normal average age? Uh, I have no idea regarding that marriage age. I, in general, they married at the age of twenty. T to uh, 25 years to 30 years by the boys okay. and the girls used to marry from 18, 18 to, to 22 22 to 23 24 uh, according to their profession even it's like us only even yeah. in our place also amar ghoro to sim tenekoi etu ejote biasia hoy so the next question is like uh, when did christianity came in mizoram in the year 1891, I suppose, 1891, the first missionary mm. came from London. London? Yeah. Okay. At the time... Who bought the, the Christianity actually? It is been bought by the, British? The, the pioneer missionaries are from London. Okay. They are called... Sapupa and Pubuanga by the Mizo people, they call their name from the Mizo name. That their real name is their English name was Mr. J. H. Lorraine and who was that? Mr. Savage. Okay. You mean that uh, the Christianity in Mizoram bought by the British? Yeah, it is. Okay. So what? Uh, what the Mizo people used to uh, pray before Christianity? Before Christianity, we have our own religion that we call Mizo Sakua. Uh, you mean, how, how do you worship? We worship? Whom do you worship? Uh, we worship Pathian. Pathian. What yeah. is that? That is God. Okay, that is God. We call them, we Pat call Pathian. Pathian. But slowly uh, you have converted, you guys have converted into Christian? Yeah, it is. And now uh, almost all the Mizo are, all the Mizos now Mizos are Christian? Christian. Uh, yeah. And there, there is no Patian who uh, worship Patian? There is no Mizo people? We still, we, we still call Patian the God of Christians are also called Patian. Okay, okay, okay. So, sir, where do you, where the Mizo language come from? Mizo language is they say it is the families of Tibeto Burman language. Okay, Tibeto Burman language. Yeah. It's a mixture of this language or what? Or they come from uh, similar from their words? Okay, that anthropologists 
say that the the Mizo language is coming from the Tibetan Burman families oh, okay, of okay. languages. I got it. Uh, are there any written words in Mizo Mizo language? Just like uh, we in English we write A B C D kind of this oh, these things. Oh yeah, no. In Mizo Mizo language, there are any words? Mm, alphabet, you mean? Uh, yeah, alphabet, just like in Hindi, ka, ka, ga, oh, ga, no, and we like have no, English, We ABC. have no alphabet by our own. So, before. how do you used to write in previous days, in the past days? In the past days, old, we don't days. have any written document. So, you, you have to, if you have to write something, how do you express by writing? We use A, B, C, we have our own alphabet, that A, O, B, C. Okay, okay. Mm, just like your go, go, go. Yeah, yeah. You have the alphabets. Yeah. I, I'm asking that only that you you have the alphabets or you have to you have just draw something to explain some some something. No, no. We have kind of my name is uh, right. My name is uh, this thing, this name. So uh, you, ha you can you write in Mizo language? Of course. In yeah, yeah. We, there is some alphabets. Yeah. I got it, sir. So I have a list of questions. Uh, I, I hope you are not getting bored, sir. No actually, I'm. I'm. Ve actually, I am very curious to know about this. Uh, about your tribe and about the Mizo, about the Christianity. That's why, sir, I am asking a lot of questions to you, yeah. and I just make you sit. Uh, I am just thinking when you get free and sit like this, I will ask one by one every question. Yeah, carry on. <laughs> so, what is the meaning of Mizoram, sir? Mizo, me literally me matlab e, human or yeah. mankind. Okay. Jo matlab pahari. Okay. Pahari matlab e, the hilly, na? The hilly, I got it. Uh, the hilly peoples are Mizo. Then drum means land. Land? Land of the hills peoples. That literally means Mizoram. Okay. That is the. So, sir, uh, you have to, uh, you have just recently said uh, our church have decided uh, what to do in the thirty first uh, yeah. December. So, our church are very strong. Have a ch our church in the, your place is very strong. Have a voice in this area. I mean, in Mizoram. Yeah, of course, the church is the biggest or organization, non-governmental organization among the Mizo people. The okay. church rules at least eighty percent of our culture, yeah. our behavior, okay. and that influence every corner of the Mizo community. Okay. Okay, sir. So, uh, uh, next is like, uh, does have any power like politics, church? Does it have any power like politics? Uh, what to say? They if kind no of uh, government have taken something wrong decision, uh, uh, the church have power to raise their voice so, oh. so that don't do that, do this one. Oh, oh I like that. They have some power. Not actually, they are non-governmental organization. They have no direct power, but they... They can raise voice? They can have some voice. Against the miscreants of the politicians. Okay, so uh, who uh, you know we have all elections uh, right. Uh, some some guys stand in election. We have to do give him vote and all. So who decided that person? Does does decide that person? What do you mean? Uh, you know, uh, from this place, from uh, Chongte. Uh, one guy is going to stand for the uh, election. Candidate. Candidate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, does people decide or the uh, church decide this thing? No, the people themselves decide. The people themselves decide now. The church has some thing that d during the election period. Yeah, yeah. They form people's forum. Okay, okay. That okay. the church. Backbone, they are the People's Forum. Okay, okay. So they ask the politician and the political parties not to do this, not to do that, okay. just to campaign like this, not to do like that, like this. Okay. Yeah, some so uh, the next question is like uh, in after Christianity came in Mizoram, so what the changes uh, have in Mizoram? 
many many changes like uh, how the people have changed there is changes i oh, so I, changes. I feel that when i am just roaming i just feel about uh, when i saw a uh, chakma tribes people and when i saw a uh, mizogai people and i feel like they're little bit happy than the chakma guys uh, i feel like that only sir so uh, what changes you uh, you have got you have seen because you are uh, so experienced and you know have you have lot of knowledge about uh, the mizoram so that's why i'm asking you what changes uh, after christianity arrived here before the christian came to mizoram the mizo people used to worship our own religion yeah our own idea we worship okay then after the introduction of the christianity in mizoram yeah every changes politically and educationally economically the christian missionaries guide us yeah so we have so many changes okay okay from the backward to the developing it's it is a positive changes everything yeah everything are positive changes but one negative change is there they left us the colonialism mindset that means we used to we used to what to say we used to worship the christian god okay but along with that we used to follow the angreji people oh every, in every corner we used to follow the culture of the angreji <laughs> missionary got it got it got it got so it so we it. left our own culture and and we are following the angreji culture culture like ah, that ah got it sir <laughs> got it there's a little mistake yeah, by yeah, the yeah, mizo yeah. community okay 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 sir uh, i have asked that uh, sunday sunday it is closed so mm. when it is started in mizoram uh from the beginning when we were christians yeah we used to observe sunday for the christianity that i mean for, for to for the church yeah gathering that means on every sunday we used to go to the church and we are gathering there to listen the gospel okay then for the whole day we used to sacrifice for the christianity okay that's why we all stop our daily life our daily duties okay for this sunday mm. we used to make the whole day for the christian okay culture i suppose for our christianity i mean okay okay so uh, so who banned the alcohol in mizoram the government or the church ha huh. it is the government by the pressure of the church leaders okay i that is church pressured government to yeah, ban the alcohol in yeah. in mizoram yes it is okay so it means that church have the power little bit voice oh of course yeah. the church had a and great it, power. it is a good thing for uh, they think for the mizo people they mm. think for you guys that you don't feel sick and don't feel uh, you know yeah it is good uh so the next is how the church becomes so much powerful <laughs> i don't know how to say <laughs> the church is everything all in all for the people of the mizo community yeah the church make our own way okay so uh if you are not involved in church like you don't go to church in sunday you are not uh, you are not a religious person how the community will see you uh they mm. will see me like a odd person odd person mm. so uh, that's why so every mizo guy used to go church by sunday by sunday yeah, right yeah 
Okay, so uh, uh, this kind of questions rushing through my mind. That's why I am asking you. You please sir, don't mind. Okay, carry on. Because uh, I'm not going to get knowledgeable person in the next time. So that's why you have so much experience and knowledge. That's why I'm just asking you. Is there any religion? Uh, is there any religion connected between uh, Mizo and Naga? Uh, that's there. Oh, because the Nagas that, are also Christian. Yeah, they are Nagas. Are they similar to you? Yes, they are. Uh, they are Christian and they are tribals of the northeast uh, people. We are very similar with each other. Okay. They are. So, sir, uh, the next is like. Uh, how many Christianity uh, uh, following in uh, Mizoram? There are, uh, you know, Baptist, Presbyterian. How uh, how much uh, uh, different type of Christian people are here in Mizoram? Uh, there are five to ten, I suppose. Let me count it now. Yeah, yeah, sure. Baptist, Presbyterian, United Pentecostal Church, hmm. Seventh Day Adventist. Oh, Salvation Army. Okay. Like that, there are small sections there. Okay, 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 okay. 